Hey guys, Zex Romney here. Today we're in another Call of Duty Ghost video, and today I'm going to be featuring another episode of Loki of Every Gun, so I do hope you enjoy it. And the gun I'm featuring today is the Vector Submachine Gun, and obviously the gameplay today I only do pick up one Loki. I do actually pick up a Chem Strike for a care package, I do show myself collecting that. And in this gameplay, I think I go 58 and 12, and sadly we do actually lose the game, but at the end of the game, you will see on the leaderboard that I do actually get 10 captures, like uh, twice as much as what everyone else got. And I was really, really trying to pull the game back from my team, but no one else is really trying, so unfortunately we do lose. And you would have seen that I do actually call in the chem strike quite early, and usually I wouldn't. Because I don't actually like it when the map is chemistrite. But I thought it would really benefit the Loki. And this is like the most kills I've ever had in a Loki. Just because I did chemistrite the map. It makes it more open and easy to use kill streaks on. I uh, so hope you enjoy the gameplay. I'm sorry that we do lose. But I do feature the Vector in this game. But obviously it's the gun I'm featuring today. Uh, the attachments if anyone is wondering that I'm using on the Vector. I wouldn't like recommend this. I, will, I, might, I might do um, when I actually do best class setup. But I didn't use many attachments. I did try Silencer. But Silencer was really really weak on the weapon. And I, find, I found it like it was a hit marker machine with silence. And to be honest, I'm not really that much of a fan of this gun. I know some people really do like the Vector, but I personally don't really like it. Uh, but I think I'm using four bit foregrip and muzzle brake on this gun today and I think it works fairly well with them too but then again the iron sights aren't my favourite I might have to try red dot out but anyway that's enough, enough about the gameplay and the guns hope you enjoy it anyway as I said I do pick up a chem strike and a care package as well as just one low key which is required for this series uh, but anyway, I actually it was my first day back at school today so obviously most people unless you like I don't know, unless you're ill or you got a longer holiday or whatever, or you got a short holiday and you went back a while ago. Uh, but anyway, I'm pretty sure most people went back to school today. And obviously, I, I think some of you will know a lot of, well, a lot of people that I speak to in real life will know that I really don't like school. Um, as I'm not a very confident person, and obviously school is quite hard for me. And I really, really don't like school, but I suppose you got to go back somewhere. And obviously, I will get used to it. It's just the whole sleeping pattern thing, because in the holidays, I suppose I was getting really, really late. I was hardly doing anything and I was going to bed at like 2-3 o'clock in the morning and then waking up about 12, half 12, uh, midday so my sleeping pattern was everywhere and going bed at, at going to bed at 10 o'clock yesterday and then waking up about 7 was really weird especially as I'm being used to waking up midday but oh well I suppose I will get back into it um, I just thought I'd mention that just wondering whether anyone else has had the same struggle as me because I kind of lost productivity Whilst on holiday, I like get really, really lazy. I always do it, and um, it is. I suppose my parents kind of get annoyed at me, if, as well, because I do get really, really lazy and start to just like sleep longer and stuff like that, which is obviously isn't good once you get back to school, because you have to obviously have to get up in the mornings. Uh, but yeah, that's about it for that. I was just wondering because I'm scrimming a lot more now, my team. I was just wondering quickly before I end the video and everything whether anyone that's watching this video knows or knows or is in a team that scrims a lot because uh, me and my clan want to start scrimming more. Uh, we ha we have got like we've played two different people, but to be honest, they've been walkovers for our team, and we want to play against people that have a set to the same skill level or maybe even better. Or probably that'd probably be best to be honest. I was just wondering whether anyone uh, knows anyone that I. We could scrim against because we want to start getting into like competitive, maybe start entering some events and stuff like that. But anyway, guys, if you did enjoy the video, remember to leave a like as usual, that'd be much appreciated. And thank you for viewing my videos once again. But anyway, guys, hope you all enjoyed the video and I hope you have a nice day. Peace.